Guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you the proper way to switch out fish tank filter replacements. You're not going to want to miss this one. Got some interesting things coming up for you. Let's hop in. Guys, we just got to Walmart. We're about to grab some replacement filters for the fish tank. So let's get right into this. So that's what I need. Do I need anything else here? Don't think so. Well, mission accomplished. I had to kind of talk quiet in Walmart because uh, there's nobody in there this morning. Uh, so let's head home and get these fish tank filters installed and replaced and we got to look out for the ops on the way home because they're out heavy today to follow the king of aquariums on all social media we are on twitter tiktok facebook and yes even tumblr what are you waiting for hit up the socials there's one of the ops he's alone Ruff. Ruff. we about to drive by on these bad boys Ruff. Yeah, so we are back home. I have the filter cartridge out now that I just purchased. It's gonna go into some tank water that I have here separated out. I'm just gonna give it a little soak. Now the reason I'm only doing one instead of changing out both of my filters there is because I like to give about 72 hours of space in between just for the bacteria colonies to catch back up for parameters to settle. I don't want to do too much at one time. But next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the old filter. I'm probably going to do the left one there, place it in with this one into the tank water. Got merch. Check below the video and in the description. If you would like to support financially and rock your favorite King of Aquariums attire, click below. Okay, so, as you can see, there is quite a bit of algae build up. I'm just gonna clean with my hands the top layer here. This algae actually helps process nitrates and I'm not too worried about the visual appearance where this particular filter is located. So all I'm gonna do basically is just remove everything here. And I've got these nifty little nitrate packages and I'm just gonna kind of mix it all together here sort of allow the bacteria to get onto this replacement kind of rub them together some squeeze out some of this don't want to do too much because i don't want to completely destroy any bacteria colonies that may be in there just going to give this part a little rinse Pause this video. Just kidding, don't pause it. It is sponsored by Swift Energy, the best energy drink on the planet, best supplement, everything. Check the link in the description. Use code AUSTIN, A-U-S-T-I-N, all caps, 25% off your entire purchase. Thank you for the support. All right, so now I'm just reinserting everything here. The new filter is already in. This is the old one, as you can see. Kind of heavily gunked up. And I actually like to put my nitrate packets before the uh, front media. And we are back in business here. And I'm gonna have the other two new ones soaking and absorbing all of that uh, bacteria here. Alrighty, and also what I'm gonna do for you guys is everything that I've used in this video, I'm actually gonna create a separate collection for in my store page so you can get all of this stuff including the fish tank filters themselves um so yeah be sure to check that out i'll leave a link in the description for you guys thank you very much i mean you watched all the way to the end and you aren't subscribed or a channel member and you still want to see some excellent fishy content be sure to hit that subscribe button 
and become a channel member to help support financially. Thank you. Stay fishy.